Okay guys, I have tried to start this vlog several times now and it is Thursday and a lot has already happened today. I got up, got ready for the day and one of the contractors is already here working on our extra bedroom. In that bedroom it had popcorn ceiling and nobody really likes popcorn ceiling anymore so we're having it removed and that's fun. Uh, but it also causes like a huge, huge mess. But it was the last room in the house with it and we're about to sell our house and so I was like, yeah, we need to give you, we need to freshen you up. So that's what's happening right now. I've got the cats in the front bathroom, which is a really small bathroom for them to be in, but there's no other room in the house that is safe for them to be in while the rest of the drywall paint repair stuff is going on. So they're stuck in there. They're not happy about it, but I really, I don't have any other room to put them in and it's only for another day well part of a day i think i don't know it won't be that long and then of course tonight like at night time i let them out and they're fine but um plus the contractors are kind of like coming in and out of the house and i don't want them to like accidentally let the cat out because my cats will try to get out and yeah i don't want to be like oh i lost my cats so yeah we're just keeping him in the bathroom. It'll be fine. I have to go get paint today. I have to go, um, first, I have to go drop off some boxes that I have in my cart to the storage. I've got an appointment at 1215. I just found out that the appointment that I have tomorrow for pictures that a new listing was actually for today, but my clients aren't ready for today. So got to see if she can do it tomorrow. If she can't do it tomorrow, I got to find somebody else to do it tomorrow because I need to have it done because we need to get this on the market. And what else I'm trying to think what else um oh i've got to go to the store and I've, i just got like i've got a list of things nothing like super critical oh oh excuse me i was like half burp half i don't know what that was but the contractor my builder just called or texted and said that the inspector red tagged us because there the water meter is like in the in the middle of the driveway and they said oh you can't do it like that and i'm like you, you you've had our plans <laughs> you've had our plans for a while now and you're just now deciding that that's going to be an issue like could you not have discovered that when we were reworking the sewer like that would have been a great time like to notice that you saw where my driveway was going to be because you saw where the garage is and naturally the, the driveway leads right up to the garage. So what's the problem? So Marvin is making some calls to hopefully get that resolved. And yeah. Um, oh, and last night we talked to the carpet guy. Apparently we like expensive carpet too. We like expensive countertops. We like expensive carpet. What else? So the carpet, he's gonna, he's a carpet broker and apparently he can get some good deals. So I'm like, work your magic, <laughs> work that magic buddy. Cause I like the nicer carpet. So apparently I like a 50 ounce carpet and it's a cut uncut style. And, but we're going to go with the six ounce pad versus the eight ounce pad. Yeah. It, uh, that makes really hardly any sense to me at all. I'm just like, okay, sure. I don't know. I'm assuming that's fine. So in the carpet that we actually liked and that we picked out was a stain master carpet. It's nylon. And he said polyester is less expensive. So he's going to try to see if he can find something that's polyester that looks like the nylon. Otherwise we'll be out a little bit of money. So again, putting us over budget, <laughs> trying to stay on budget. So that's what I'm up to today. I'll take you along with me the places I go. I'm going to show a house at 1215. It's a small house, so there's not really not much to see. But yeah, that's the agenda today. So, okay, come with me. Just kidding, I'm not leaving yet, but I'm about to leave, so. Look, guys, I'm at the storage unit. I have not been here in a hot minute, but I have a couple boxes in my trunk, and I'm going to pick up paint later. There's no room in my trunk, so I've got to come and get these boxes unloaded. Then I'll have room in my trunk for the paint. 
and I can get on with my day. But I've got a 12.15 appointment, so I gotta go to that. But that'll just take like a few minutes. Then I can get back onto my errands, and I've gotta write up a summary of the repairs that my clients would like made on the home, and then we can move forward. So that'll be exciting. All right, guys, well, let me go get the boxes out of the trunk. I'm at Dollar General now because I need cat litter and oh, that sounds like a big dog. And I need um what do you call it? Hairspray. So here we go. I know y'all like those fancy eyebrow kits, but literally the ultimate ultimate brow kit. Three shades, LA colors. Three dollars. Three dollars, y'all. I mean that's for sure taking it back old school. And I didn't even realize they made this anymore. For real, y'all. And this pert. There used to be one that was called Gee, Your Hair Smells Terrific. Like that was the whole name of it. And then Body on Tap. Made with beer. So. <laughs> Just uh, taking it back old school, y'all. Okay, so this is a rent house, and I'm showing you after we're already inside, but they've converted the garage into another bedroom. So this has three bedrooms and one bath. They've got this big laundry room area, which is kind of dark, it's hard to see, but I don't know what it used to be, but it's a pretty big area for a laundry room. Here's the kitchen, and rent houses around here don't typically come with the refrigerator. And cabinets. And this is dining room. Go into, you got a clothes closet, you got a living room area. Then the two other bedrooms are back here. One, two, and a bathroom. Okay, I just met my client at the office so she could turn in her app and her app fee. So, bam, gonna get it done today, y'all. Now I've gotta go get paint. I was gonna get paint because they were gonna start tomorrow, but they might start priming and such today. So I gotta go get the primer. Might as well get the rest of the paint while I'm there. And yeah, so stuff is happening. Did I tell you that we got a red tag for the driveway? Well, we did. So the city said, oh, you can't have this meter here. And then there was a whole thing about, they knew the meter was there. Why are you just telling me now that we can't do it? So. Now they're saying yes you can, but there's nobody there still pouring the concrete yet, so maybe they'll start pouring tomorrow. We'll see. Now I'm at Lowe's, trying to get the paint and the primer. And try not to waste too much time in here. Okay, y'all know that I was just at Lowe's to buy paint. And then they asked me what sheen I wanted. Do I want flat? Do I want eggshell? Do I want satin? Semi-gloss, gloss? I don't I don't know. I need like specific instructions on what to get. So I asked Marvin, I asked the guy that's working on the house and they don't know. So I'm like, okay. So I came back and I look inside a cabinet and guess what? We have paint y'all. We have gallons of paint. Now granted, it's been in the garage for a little bit, just a hot minute. And I probably need to take it to Lowe's to get it shook back up. but. I mean, at least I don't have to buy some of that paint. That saves me some dollars. 
I think like paint is anywhere from like 25 to 40 something. So even at the cheapest, I'm saving myself like 50, 60 bucks. So it's not too bad, but still need more paint. So this is what is happening. We're refinishing some areas and putting, we're gonna paint this areas and the cats are locked up in the bathroom and they're not happy. they stop so they're gonna prime today paint tomorrow and they'll be done so <laughs> that's good but we also have to fix tile in the living room so I'm not sure when we're gonna start that probably Tuesday and that'll take them about two days so that will put us at um, by finishing Friday I don't know I've got to call the carpet guy and see when he can come out because um, he can come out as early as like Monday then. If they're done with this like tomorrow, we can then, then we can have them come out Saturday, Sunday, meantime after that. So I do have to pull up the flooring in that bedroom. It has laminate flooring and it's like, you know, and I'm putting carpet in there. So I gotta call the carpet guy, see when he can come out in the next few days and get all that scheduled. Such a lovely time. Oh, I was going to tell you guys, I was at Lowe's trying to use a store credit and apparently Marvin had gotten the credit. And so she says, oh, um, she gets asked for my driver's license. So I was like, oh, okay. So I give it to her and she's like, oh, um, this is not matching up. You're not the one that got the store credit, so you can't use it. And I'm like, lady, not today. <laughs> not today, lady. So I was like, okay, uh, it's probably my husband, maybe my dad, but I mean, it was for a project for my house and you know, she goes, well, um, so she wasn't gonna let me use it because it was under his driver's license number. <laughs> okay, so we got past that, did a workaround. But I'm like, man, just one thing after another. I'm at the office now and I'm having a heck of a day like so much is going on right now I just like need I don't know I bet I don't have time to have a break so so here's something that happened today so we got a call or we got the notification that the city did not approve or red tagged our inspection for the driveway so we're like what you've had our plans for forever like how did you not see this and whose fault is this because it's not my fault so long story short we thought it was the city but then marvin and i were just looking at the elevation plans and i'm like honey the driveway is supposed to go around that water meter thing and then it wouldn't have been an issue i don't know it may still have like been right there but i think it was supposed to curve around so yeah i don't know now I've got to put together a kind of synopsis of what repairs that my buyer is wanting for the house that we have under contract and solidify that. The pictures that we were supposed to take tomorrow, my photographer thought was for today. That didn't happen, obviously, because they're not fully ready. And we're ready till tomorrow. So I've got to see if she'll do Friday if she has any time available, which she originally said she really didn't. So, I don't know. I'll have to find somebody else, but that's like last minute. I don't know if I can find somebody else to do that. <sighs> and I've only used her. Like, since I started real estate, I've only used this one photographer, which, you know, I mean, you know, she's always been able to help me. So, we'll see if we can work that out. And, uh, yeah. Saturday, the carpet guy is supposed to come over and show me some samples, which I don't know. Just like pick a carpet. It's like, somebody else make a decision. I'm kind of tired of picking things right now. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do for dinner because, yeah, my house is a complete, like, my house is just like one big tarp, basically. So, I don't know. But, I'm going to go in and do this little synopsis of the repairs that we're wanting, um, or like our minimum repairs needed. And then we, I'm going to go visit with them tonight, 
probably pick up something for dinner and bring it home and let my poor little cats out of that freaking bathroom. <laughs> They're like stuck in the bathroom. I feel so bad for them. But I'm like, it's going to all be over with tomorrow. It's going to all be done tomorrow. So, um, well, at least the um, painting and the, all that, kind of, the painting and stuff. But um, we'll have carpet probably Monday-ish. And then um, uh, tile work done Tuesday and Wednesday. And then we'll be cleaning up all the things. So if you want to come over and help me clean, you can. I don't mind. But I think I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here because I just don't know how much more time um, I've got. I've just got to chunk, you know, like churn some things out. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. Feeling a little like this today. And uh, yeah, but I hope you guys are having an awesome day. And I will see you tomorrow. Bye.